Now, 41 NBC Sports from the Jeff Smith Board of Byron Sports Center. It's time for Friday Night Football Scores and Highlights. You're in the end zone. Brought to you in part by Ortho Georgia, The Sanford Company, Capital Cycle, and Dent Doctor of Macon. With Bill Shanks and Tucker Sargent. Good evening, everyone. Welcome to the end zone. I'm Tucker Sargent filling in for Bill Shanks this week. Later on, we'll have our game of the week. Two Bibb County schools going head to head at Henderson Stadium. We'll also have, have action from Fort Valley, Warner Robins, and Gray. We start in Macon with two other Bibb County teams. West Side was at home against West Lawrence. Both the Seminoles and Raiders came in undefeated. West Lawrence had outscored its opponents 117 to 13. Yeah while the Seminoles were coming off a 20-point win at Harris County. The Knolls won big last year in Dublin. This meeting at the Ed DeFore Sports Complex. Here come the Seminoles and the Raiders on the other side. Knolls with some action first. The give to Dante Pate. Nice move there. Gets some nice blocks and works his way to the 46-yard line. Then the Knolls to the air. Beautiful throw by Savion Knowlton. Jeremy Mitchell says, block for me, Steve Dolphus. Mitchell to the 25. Then read option. Knowlton. As Bill Shanks would say, he gone. 7-0 after the kick. Wes Lawrence into West Side territory. And then Jalen Mack pulls a Jeremy Johnson. Remember that Auburn's quarterback last week? Goodness. It's Edward Veal with the pick, but uh, they would give it right back. Knowlton back to pass under pressure, and he throws it right to Dorian Gorham. Gorham all the way for the touchdown. Extra point block, so it was 7-6. West side, there's the block. Seminoles back to work. Knowlton from his own end zone, and he's taken down for his safety. Wes Lawrence takes an 8-7. Lead and the Raiders were not done scoring. Second quarter, Darius Bradford, 19 yards for the score. Wes Lawrence led 15 7 after the kick, but Westside comes back. The Seminoles win at home 27 24. Across town to Thompson Stadium, Northeast hosting Upson Lee. The Raiders and the Knights are play of the week right off the bat. Jacquez Durham. Comes in here with a hit for Northeast, but Quay Revere never actually went down. Coach says, go Quay. And Quay goes all the way. 65 yards and a touchdown. 7 nothing. Ups and Lee. Northeast would fumble the ensuing kickoff. Give it to Quay again. Get off me. Touchdown. 14 nothing. Northeast unable to score, had to punt it away. Ups and Lee threatening again. Kalen Puckett loses the ball. Nolan Ussery recovers for Northeast. About the only highlight Northeast had tonight, unfortunately. A few plays later, Ussery at quarterback. He's in trouble. Third down and that's ugly. Just ugly. Ups and Lee dominated this game, or Quay Revere did anyway. Goes in for the score here. 21-0. Second quarter. Quay again. 27 nothing. Rough night for the Raiders. Shut out at home. 41 nothing. The final score. We'll have the region opener for Peach County and Southwest when we come back. You're watching the end zone on 41 NBC.